Hey, okay. Okay, guys. So finally, we all are now school leavers. Yeah! But, not if you fail yourself, so. Nobody's failing. It's not the same thing we all would do. Oh. If one fails, others fail too. Straight up. No, I, don't, I don't think so. We all didn't write the same thing. The hardworking ones among us wrote quite differently. Like me. I see you. <laughs> Look at this man. We look like you. You copied from everybody. <laughs> so, I beg go. You don't amount yourself, fool. Fool. What's that? <laughs> okay, come guys. Hey. What do you think? Let's just do something. Mm -hmm. Something fun. Yeah, something steamy or sweaty. Yeah. You're cooking. <laughs> something interesting and dangerous. I like to do steamy or sweaty. Okay, fine. Let's do this. Let's look for a very rich bachelor and break into his own man. Do something, you know. Uh, which rich bachelor are you breaking to his house? I don't think there are still rich bachelors in this town. How did you know? Ah. Um, Frank, what do you think? Well, I think Ken is going to be a very dangerous criminal. <laughs> you, have to, you have to see his eyes. <laughs> oh, think, 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 think. Hmm. Never ask him what he thinks, man. But you know what, guys? I think Angela's right. Angela's right. <laughs> Why don't we go to the beach? What beach? That dirty place. We are not going to swim. Let's go shoot. Yes! Shoot waiting! Target shooting. I can provide the gun. <laughs> okay, so can um can you help us uh maybe get a transport or something? Sure. Okay. They do that. <laughs> Let's go. They're celebrating. What are we celebrating? Like everyone else. I, I just feel the battle is barely begun. Begun? Come on. You need to give yourself some break. Take a moment to enjoy the moment. Are you? Are you taking a moment? It feels like I'm doing that right now. Mary, can I call you?
My bad. You asked me to come. I did. Jonah said he wanted to see me. What were you doing? Nothing. How was it? It was good. Um, we are going out later today. So you just go home and get ready. I'd rather not go anywhere today.
that is still a car in this country. Uh, uh, eh? oh, you know it's not as easy as opening your leg to a guy. Oh, stop that. that. What is that? What kind of rubbish is that? Please, 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 please shut up your mouth. Please, 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 please. Can you imagine? Please, please, please. Get out. Not <laughs> funny. No, no, no. <laughs> well, she's not funny. Well, she's not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> to apologize for the other day. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I know I messed up as usual. And I'm sorry. It's okay. Don't sweat it. You're not the only one to sleep with. It's a public knowledge. I know, I know, but I, I still feel bad. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's I'm okay. sorry. It's okay. Mary, you're better than the rest of us. I wish I could. You deserve more. He's here. And you are here. You, you, you shouldn't be with us. You have no business being with us. That, my friend, is a fact. You, you, you should be with more commonsensical people. Commonsensical? Oh. <laughs> yeah, commonsensical. Come on, I did go to high school after I can see that. <laughs> Mary, if you stay with us long enough, you will lose yourself. Get out. Babe, there's nothing for you here. Okay? Yeah, they are. It's about time. Don't you get inside the bus? You always slow and it's very, very annoying. Where's the guy now? Uh, he's supposed to be waiting for us around here. Let me just let me just call him. Let me call him. Oh, please! Ah. Look at him there. Thank you. 
Guy, where did they go now? You saw 20 minutes, Frank. I did. And 20 minutes was 10 minutes ago. Guy, yeah, get in, get in. You are crazy. Get in. Let's get, let's get out of here. Come on. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi, Mike. Where are you going to? It doesn't matter. Just get in, man. Let's, let's get out of here. Mm -hmm. I'm busy. Did you say busy? You just finished your exams today. What can you be possibly be busy with? Mike. We just finished the battle and the soldiers ought to celebrate. No! No! The war you're talking about is just about to begin. Yeah, come on, let's, let's go, let's go. Frank, there's no sense going out with a man who doesn't know where he's going to. Enough of this, Yeah, enough of it. I wait now! I wait, wait! Mike, wait! Where are we going to? Just calm down. There's a lot in that jungle that I know you cannot afford to miss, especially one. I don't understand. What are you talking about? Well, why don't you just come? Take a look at the jungle. If you like what you see, you come with us. If you don't like what you see, then fine. But first, let's go! <laughs> Guys, this is it. I said it. Say what? See how dirty this place is. This is dirty. Ew! This place is so dirty. So, you mean all my efforts now? Yes. <laughs> oh, please, I always laugh like a bull. Feel so bad. That's good, man. Okay, then. Are they shooting this cancer? Yes! So, where are we going now? What are we going now? I want to shoot. I want to shoot. Let us go to the bar. Let's not see that. Let's not see that. Let's not see that. Let's not see that. Let's not I'm sure you are not the only one. Just what do you have anything in mind? Hmm. I would choose Air Force and Navy. What? But why the force? Yeah, because I like it. I like sure. Exactly. I wish we had done the target shooting thing. I would have killed it. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, what about you? Hmm. I want to be a drug dealer. <laughs> what? You 
just said you want to be a drug dealer and you brought, brought out a weed. Same reason you want to be a politician, right? I, I never said I wanted to be a politician. That sounds like what a politician would say. <laughs> what, what is that? You always laugh like a monkey. Oh, where is it now? Eno. As, 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 oh. as if it. She said she was going out with those same guys again. You know her. As usual. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the weed. Okay. At least I'm better than her. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I saw you earlier. I saw you first. I told you guys. What do you want? I'm here to help. You. Help us? What's wrong with us? Are we sick? Why are you helping us? Come, let me show you the future. Who are you? The ritual speaks. You just called him. The guy. But you are so good. Do you know why? He's the poorest of the poorest. You see this moment. I see it all. Hey, calm down. What are you? A suitsay or what? <laughs> it's like you on a death. <laughs> if you knew what life has in store for you, you will stop feeling about And not like this, you say. And what are you? Why? Why does this here tell you the future? I show it to you. Wouldn't life be so much easier if you know what would be? Or complicated. Pardon? Knowing what could be could make life more complicated than it is for most of us. If you knew that in 10 years to come, he would die, stabbed through his trough, drowning in his own blood. Don't you think he would do things differently to avoid the occurrence of such unfortunate incidents? He could do that, or he may die a year from now, because he has been consumed by the thoughts of an event that may or may not occur. Joe, your music is good, but you constantly wonder Will I ever make it big? Will I become a star? Oh, if you knew, stardom would be the least of your worries. I knew what. And you, will I make it to the academy? Will I be accepted? And you, will I find the right guy? And you are the key. Everyone. Key to what? What about me? Tell me my future. Did I get to go out with you? I told you. I don't just tell you. I show you. Do you want to see? Hold hands and close your eyes. Close your eyes.
You watched. You bastard. Peace because I killed you in the future. I swear, if your hand touches me again, I will kill you here and now. Hey! Stop! It is so. It's fragments of a complex situation. I need to go back and understand it. You mean go back and die again? No way. There's no way that's going to happen. I've seen it all and I understand it. You killed me in the future. But that's not going to happen. Killing you! Oh, you can't. You saw what happened when you tried. I killed you. We'll see. Mary, let's leave here, right? She's not going. She is going with me. Mary stays. I can't. I'm going with you. You see? She must go with you. You know why? Because I own her. She is mine. I see you want what I have, yeah? Well, here's the news, boy. You can't have what I have. You see, her father, her late father, was a policeman. A loser policeman. And lucky for him, a friend of my father. You shout at me again, I swear to God, I will kill you with my bare hands right here. As I was saying, before I was really interrupted, my father saved her late father so many embarrassing situations. I took care of this one, man. And guess what? He had that wish, and that is that I stay with this one. What do you say? Make no sense to me. I'm sorry. That's what my father wanted. My father is dead. Dead. People don't want anything. Only the living doors. Uh -huh. You are alive. What do you want? Okay. Guys, let's get the hell out of here. I'm sorry, Mike, but you know me. I've always followed the path of your existence. Jane, my misery. It's for whatever security. Take care. Because I need you. Frank, are you going to get off? Please, don't assault me. I've always knew this whole thing was a bad idea. <laughs> Most bad idea. What's funny? This is how you became rich. When you left here, you became crazy rich. What are you talking about? Why are you speaking in past tense? Because I am still here and I have not left. Oh, but you have. Let's go. The lady is suddenly creeping. Many things will stand in your way. Don't be one of them. Frank!
Maybe what is keeping you there? I'm coming. I'm waiting. You don't smile. Why should I smile? You paid for my body and not my smile. So do what you have to do and let me leave here. Don't bother I'm not shouting. Why won't I shout? Do what you have to do and let me get out of this place, please. please. Stop shouting. I'm not shouting. Just do what you have to do and let me go. So what will you talk to me that way? Why would I talk to you like that? What would you do? What would you do if I talk to you like that? What is what I would do? I'm asking, what would you do? Hey, what is what I would do? Yes, what would you do? What would you do if I talk to you? What is what I would do? Oh, Mary, you're better than the rest of us. I wish I could. You deserve more. He's here. And you are here. You, you, you shouldn't be with us. You have no business being with us. That, my friend, is a fact. You, you, you should be with more commonsensical people. Commonsensical? Oh. <laughs> yeah, common sense. Go, come on, I did go to high school. After I all. can see that. <laughs> Mary, if you stay with us long enough, you will lose yourself. Get out. Babe, there's nothing for you here. Okay? I'm sorry. That's what my father wanted. Your father is dead. Dead. You don't want anything. Only the living doors. Uh -huh. You are alive. What do you want? How much is this? For all this long distance? Huh? Huh? How much is this now?
My God! Have this for your friends. Go home and have the baby. That man is a beast. Boss, he pays well. Yes, but when it's done taking its turn, then and only then can we get to have that to. You know what? Be strong. Huh? Maybe for a couple of years. Who knows? We may have something like this. <laughs> Annabelle, I don't understand what the problem is, if you ask me. Because you have a beautiful house, two lovely kids, fleet of cars, caught to the Rich man you married. Yes. So I don't know what it is. Now tell me. Is this not the dream you've always dreamed of? Because I know you are one person among us who, has, who will got to leave her dreams. So hey, be thankful to your stars. You should be grateful. You don't understand. I understand perfectly. Perfectly well that dreams are, are not easy to realize. Baby, sometimes it's not how hard you try. Because I tried very hard. I tried so hard, yet. <laughs> Others have it in a hard way. Others have it hard. You should appreciate what you are given, okay? Moreover, that is what you asked for. So I don't know what the problem is, really. I know, but Angela, I am just the house mom. At the 27th year of my life, I am just a stay at the home mom. This is so boring and sickening. Uh, you know, all been, what all Ben tells me is I refill your wardrobe. I provide you with whatever you want. I pay the bills. So what else do you want? Angela, that is not what I want. Is it not right? What else could you ask for, Annabelle? Hey, don't complicate your life. Do you understand? Don't complicate your life. Why don't you just relax and enjoy this life? If you ask me, your life is a cozy kind of life. Why don't you just relax and enjoy it? No worries. Huh? Mm -hmm. Cabbage? That's all I'll tell you. Lila, my life is so tight and ill.
that? Who is that? Angela, you can't open this door. Grace? Grace, when did you get into town? Wait. What is this? What? I said we should come to you. Who said you should come to me? The king's not for us. What did you do? You must be kidnapped. What? What? They said they will call you in a few minutes time. Now you must speak with them or... Oh, well, just let me please just... So if you just go and sit. What? Oh, Grace, you go. No, no, stop. If you will not stop and talk to me, then you stop. Don't. What happened? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, please. Thank you. Give me what? We got a call from our nanny. Okay. Around 12. Telling us Chinyo has been abducted by some armed men on his way back from school. Just then, I tried calling the police, but, but, but I got another call, at this time from the kidnappers, telling me to stand by for instructions and never to call the police. Just two hours ago, they called with those instructions. What do they want? I'm going to talk to you alone. I persuaded them to speak with myself or Grace. They insisted they needed to speak with you. And we drove as fast as we can. I will be tried your both times, but they were switched off. Why did you switch off your phone? Why? Because they are mine. Why did they want to talk to me? Excuse me. Wait. Who do you want to call? Don't call me. Angela, you can call anybody right now, but not the police. Yes, they specified that in that instruction. At least let's know what they are after. Junior's life is at stake here. Please don't go. Miss Booms on the line. Miss Angela Bond. Yes, Miss Booms. I have your nephew with me. And I have no need for him. I want you to come and take him home. And when coming, do not forget. Come with the package you stole from me. What package? Angela Bombs. I have many things. But patience is not one of them. I'm giving you two days. Angela, what are we going to do now? Talk. They
Never point your gun on a naked man. That's the rule. A major rule that everybody knows. What kind of silly rule is that? I have two guys in the house. What have you done today? You'll find out. No more. So. So what about all these visits? Just need an information about your supplier. You a policeman? Oh. Do I look like a policeman? Who knows what they look like these days? Moreover, I'm not behind any payments. The month is still young. And I will pay before the end of the month. For the last time, I am not the police. If you're not a policeman, then who are you? I just need your supplier's name. And I also need Buari to legalize marijuana. Which both of us know that's not what happened. We're not going to get what we want. <laughs> Forget about that gun, because I know you're not going to kill me. You sound so sure. Why is that? It may sound so funny to you. Listen, 10 years ago, I met a lady at the beach who showed me my future. That I was 80. That the president was giving me a presidential honor. And most of the things she told me has happened. Even some are already happening. So you see, the president gave you a national honor. Mm -hmm. And you're a drug dealer. <laughs> well, we've lived long enough, I'll forget. Listen, I don't deny. I revolved. I became a new man. Can you imagine? Is that right? <laughs> now I'm going to tell you the reason why I didn't kill you tonight. I didn't kill you tonight because you gave me the information that I want. And now I'm going to ask you for the very last time. What is your supplier's name? <sighs> okay, okay. Call him Sly. I've never seen him. I don't know what he looks like. The name is all I need. The name is all I need. I guess we'll be seeing each other again. So. You guys are just bunch of fools.
You're looking good. Thank you. How are you? The package came from Shadow. You had it left. For me. For me. I don't know. Maybe. One of the secret admirers. Mama, I'm gonna click that thing. Girls like me don't have things like that. <laughs> no need to be so. Feeling broken? <laughs> then what the flight? I'll fix you. From the friend who never forgets. A flight for you. Hmm. <laughs> my mind. What's the friend? Hmm. I don't have any friends. You can't be so negative. Listen to me. You can't see how God. This is God answering you. Telling you he didn't forget you. What, what exactly are you saying? What if he's there? What if he's the one that sent this? How will life face him? You worry too much. If he's the one that sent this, then that means he still loves you. Yes? I'm married. Are you? Listen, you are young and you're beautiful. If it is not your husband, he didn't even pay any bride price on your head. 
He only got you pregnant and went ahead to brutalize you until you lost the child. I've always wondered why you still stay. Why you never left. Maybe you thought you, you don't want anything to anyone anymore. But this, this proves you wrong. So you will go to that party and never come back, no matter how it turns out. Never come back? Yes. What are you coming back for? There is nothing for you here. Not now, nor ever. You have 150,000 here. Take it. The ticket to a new life. Disappear. Start a new life. That's the least you can do for yourself. Rise and shine. Hello, Sly. I've got questions for you. Who are you? They call me. Shut up. I wasn't talking to you. I'm talking to your boss. I only talk to one. Want something for me?
कौन सा है हाउ डिड यू नो सिक्स वॉट I quite agree with you, but I don't want any problem. You don't want any problem, and yet you kidnap me. Yes, I actually brought you here to rectify an existing misunderstanding between you and my friend. You want to rectify an existing issue with me, and the only way you could do that is by kidnapping me. Exactly. Miss Bones is my friend. You don't want to get it from already involved. And that is why I want you to leave her alone. She has something of mine. An eye of hers. All I ask is for a simple exchange. She is a drug law enforcement agent. In her line of duty, she sees the drug. Now that's the problem. You know? I mean, I pay her bosses. She refused to follow orders. She got herself involved into this mess. She's already disposed them. Then I have no choice. Her nephew dies. You won't. Am I interested to know that he has been released and she is coming over to pick him? You don't know what you're getting yourself. Like I told you, I don't go into any war I want you to. Let me tell you, I know everything about you. I know where you live, your touch houses, your distributors, your suppliers. Like I earlier said, I don't want any problems and that is why I want you to leave her alone. That's only if she will leave my business alone. You. But I have something else to show you. What? is your calling. But today, you don't have the means to. So I will beg you to forget about it. Junior, how are you? I'm fine, Uncle. You see, storms of life are part of life. Someday you will grow up to be a man. And then you will realize that the challenges of life have no time to be. Okay? Thank you, Uncle. You're welcome. Angela, take good care of you. Sure of you. Thank you. Let's not cry. Thank you. 
Hello, Miss John. You're welcome. We've been expecting you. Sorry, please. Who are you? I work for your host. My host? Please, who's my host? They asked me to bring you to him or you meet your other friends at the city. My other friends? Ooh. You'll see. Please come. I was thinking. Can I call you back? Mike! Hi! Mike! I feel like a sissy, I would say. Therein lies my mystery. If only I could go back to that beach. <sighs> like, I'm a mess. I'm a total mess. A mess. 
mess is clinical. If only you allow me. I mean, I could help you. I have a very large heart and a deep pocket. Why are you so kind? Why are you so kind to me? I found no reason not to be. Because I believe in you. See, I, I believe, believe in this future that lies before you. Come on. I mean, it's bright and beautiful. It's okay. Come on, chill. Chill. Put a smile on this charming face of yours. Let's join the others. Okay. We'll talk about this future of yours at the end of the party. No, oh, it's okay. Thank you so much. It's okay. Thank you. It's okay. I have a I have to Tell us how you made your fortune. Yeah, yeah, tell us. <laughs> right. I listened to Frank. You know, 10 years ago at the beach, he talked about information technology. How huge and rewarded the industry could be. I listened, and he was right. Of course I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> I own a company known as Pomotech, working for top government officials and companies. Oh, yeah. You guys have no idea how much IT technology schools apply. Wow. Yeah. Um, <laughs> congrats. I'm um, sorry, excuse me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
it's time to wake up. Twin brother, Mike. I had a twin. The nurses said he died at birth. Everything we saw has some logical pattern. Are you saying Peace and Jonah will die ten years from now? Is he right? Be reasonable, guys. Be reasonable. And don't look back. I am not ever you without you. I have a plan. A good plan for you. Well, you didn't leave me. Go. Take the 10 years and come back for me if you must. It's a better plan. She's right. She saw the future. I am the captain of my ship, the master of my feet. I make my own future. You make your own future. You are the captain of your ship. The master of your feet. You make your own future. And you, and you, and even you, Emo. Our future is not written in stone. We mold our destinies. That's right. Is he? Yes. The future you saw is a product of the path you are on right now. If we change your path, it will cause more to our face. You hate her. You hate her too. If I follow you, it will affect your future. For the better, come with me. No. You can come for me when you have made it. But I must go with you. <sighs> Like Mike will say, it makes no sense following a man who does not know where he's going. Mike has a large heart and with time, a deep pocket. Go with him. I would if I were you. I will go with you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Why would the president want to see you? I told you so. I don't know. You know what? You don't know him. But he asked specifically for you. The moment his jet touched the ground, when he has given access, you know, the senior executive yet, and you are here telling me you don't know him? No, 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 no. I, I, I don't know, sir. No, 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 no. I think. No. Sorry, sir, do I know you? No. You don't know me at all. But you said you don't know. I don't, sir. God. My boss will see him alone now. He's by the pool, sir. It is not every day that one gets to see the future. And most important of all, the path that leads to that future. But when you get to see that future and decide to turn your back at it, that, my friend, is madness. There is a reason why things become places. There is a reason why things become okay. It is not because they are the most intelligent, nor the strongest, nor the most gifted in the land, but because right from when they were born, all they think about is how to become king. Unlike you, my friend, you don't pass the opportunity to be. Yeah, you're right. Thank you. 